Hi guys, it's Jason here with another Humpy Report, and today we are breaking down the Oregon Ducks farting to cow 21-17. Um, it was a bag of mixed bags for the Oregon Ducks. We'll get to it. Uh, let's go over the score on the cow led after the one at 7-3. Um, in the second quarter, the most productive quarter by far. For the Oregon Ducks, 14 points. They had a 17 to 14 lead. Um, Cal gets seven points in the second half. And that's all she wrote. Um, Oregon got shut out in the second half. Um, they had a drive. They had a three possessions in the Cal's territory. They just fumbled, turnover on downs, and another turnover. Um, the last Oregon player was a Johnny Johnson um, fumble. And it was, he caught the ball. Cal um, defender hit him and fumbled at the ball. It was a good hit, good play by Cal. Um, but to, I believe if Oregon doesn't fumble, I, I think Shaw leads us down at the field and um and it scores the win and the touchdown. But that didn't happen. That's fine. Um, Oregon drops to three and two. Cal improves to one and three. Um, Suck was, he was okay. 14 out of 26. Um, 231 and a touchdown. Uh, 52 yards on the ground. Uh, not very much in the second half. Um. The the offense in the second half was it looked it to me kind of confusing. Um, and when I say that, Travis Starr was the best running back that Oregon had last night. Um, the the only gripe that I have with the coach and the staff is Travis Starr would be getting big ones, ten yards here, fifteen yards here, and wanna. And getting on it to rhythm, but it won't be so bad for Vidal or CB Alecchio, um, and really ruins the momentum of that drive. Um, but um, it, it wasn't meant to be for Oregon. Uh, this Cal team has really had a Cal's number. Um, had has had Oregon's number last year, even with Justin Herbert. Oregon scored at 17 points against Cal. And the Cal last year didn't have such scholars, which played an okay game. Um, 20 out of 32, 183, won a touchdown for the Cal quarterback. Um, and why not? Um, Dyer was the best wide receiver that Oregon had two catches, 85 yards. Um, but the defense for Oregon, I thought, played very well. Um, they stopped Cal under two yards per carry. Um, 271 they gave up. Um, another 21 points. Um, but in most days, that's going to be enough. Uh, especially for Oregon's offense. Uh, it just wasn't there. Um, it's... Taylor suck a bad quarterback? No, it's you gotta realize this is Taylor Suck's fifth game started in the Carters. I know he's a three year guy and he's been at Oregon and whatnot, but this is his fifth game starting. You're gonna get some mixed bats. Um and especially in twenty twenty, it's it's an odd year in general. Um, so you gotta get what you're gonna get. Um, I know every Duck fan's looking forward to next year. Ty Thompson, um, a very good quarterback, a five star quarterback. I believe that he's gonna have every opportunity to win the job next year. Um, still, I'm still a Taylor Shark guy. Um, why not? Could he could have done better? Yes, absolutely. But um, it's it's just weird year all all the way around. Let's but is it time to burn everything down and fire every coach or 
a one eye and organs in a spin. No, absolutely not. Um, you you look at an organ that has the most freshman sophomores playing in the nation. Um, so you gotta get youthfulness. Don't forget who opted out for Oregon and Penetua a um a Thomas Graham on defense, a Javon Harden at safety, our best safety up that out, and one eye. And Oregon at least two games lost by combined seven points. Okay. Like I said, if Jordan Johnson doesn't fumble the ball, I believe Oregon wins this game. I believe Oregon scores. Um, against the Beavers in the Civil War, you know, a couple plays here and there could have went Oregon's way too. So, um, this team's not that far behind um, in the one out. I've been a Duck fan, and this is probably not top five risk. Um, so, um, it's it's a process. Um, I know Chris DeBar is a very good recruiter, but you got to let him get three full classes under his belt. He's only got one or two. Um, that's his class is a top five class. So just, it's, it's going to, there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Um, I'm not panicking. Um, and Oregon's going to be fine. So what's coming up next for Oregon? Oregon still could win the package of North, even these last two weeks. Um, they got Washington, 1 o'clock next weekend on Fox. Um, and the cow has the Cougars. So, um, can Oregon get it right? Um, they're close. They just got to get it over the hump. So, once again, like always, every weekend during the fall, you have a video. You have two videos from me talking about ducks. And like, like always, like, subscribe, comment on Facebook. Let's chit chat. Uh, do you agree? Do you disagree? Uh, are you in the different or whatnot? Let's chat. I love to chat about football, football, basketball, baseball, whatever. And we'll. We'll chat it up. So like always, go Ducks and have a great day.